This is video number six on puzzles on numbers. Let's get started with the first question. A number consists of three digits whose sum is 10. The middle digit is equal to the sum of other two. The number will be increased by 99 if its digits are reversed. Then the number is. So we have the three digit number. So let's consider it as x, y, z and its value will be 100x plus 10y plus z. Then we have been given that if the digits are reversed then the original number is increased by 99. So the reverse digits are z, y and x. So its value is 100z plus 10y plus x. And it is given that that if the digits are reversed then the original numbers value is increased by 99. So we have reversed the digits. Let's write it 100z plus 10y plus x is equal to the original number plus 99. So the original number is 100x plus 10y plus z plus 99. So in this equation we can cancel out 10y and then what remains is 100z plus x equals to 100x plus z plus 99. So 100z minus z is 99z is equal to 100x minus x is 99x plus 99. Dividing this whole equation throughout by 99, we get z equals to x plus 1. Now we can keep it for future use. Let's see what are the other things that have been given to us. So the three digit number XYZ has digits whose sum is 10. So we have X plus Y plus Z is equal to 10. We have that another equation. Then we have that the middle digit is equal to the sum of other two. So the middle digit is Y which is equal to the sum of other two which is X plus Z. So we have three equations, three variables. We can find out the value of all of these three variables. So let us put the value of z in this equation. We get x plus y plus x plus 1 is equal to 10. Now what we have is 2x plus y plus 1 is equal to 10. Now we can put the value of y in this equation again. So we get 2x plus x plus z plus 1 equals to 10. Now again we have a z here so we can put the value of z from this equation in this equation. So we have 2x plus x is 3x plus z is again x plus 1 plus this one is equal to 10. So we have 4x plus 2 is equal to 10. So 4x is equal to 8 therefore x is equal to 2. So x's value is 2, z can be found out which is x plus 1, so z equals to x plus 1, x is 2, so 2 plus 1, therefore z is equal to 3. And y's value is x plus z, so y is equal to x is 2 and z is 3, therefore y is equal to 5. So this number x, y, z is equals to 2, 5, 3. This is 253 and that is our answer. Let us move on to the second question now. A certain number of two digits is three times the sum of its digits. If 45 are added to the number then the digits are reversed. Then what is this number? So the number is of two digits which are x and y. So the value is 10x plus y. And it is three times the sum of its digits. So the value of this number which is 10x plus y is equal to three times the sum of its digits. So three times the sum of its digits which is x plus y. So 10x plus y is equal to 3x plus 3y. So we move the x and y's to the left hand side of equal to. So 10x minus 3x is 7x plus y minus 3y gives you minus 2y equals to 0. So we have an equation right there. Let us see what other equations can we get. If 45 are added to the number 
then the digits are reversed so if we add 45 to this number then the digits are reversed so we can write 10 x plus y plus 45 is equals to the digits are reversed so x y becomes y x so y x is value is equal to 10 y plus x now we can solve this 10 x minus x gives you 9 x plus plus y minus 10 y gives you minus 9 y so minus 9 y plus 45 is equal to 0 dividing this whole equation throughout by 9 we get x minus y plus 9 5 is a 45 so 5 is equal to 0 let us solve this again x is equals to y minus 5 so we can put this x equals to y minus 5 here in this equation we get 7 times y minus 7 times 5 so minus 35 minus 2y is equal to 0 7 my, minus 2y is 5y which is equal to 35 therefore y is equal to 7 so y's value is 7 x's value is 7 minus 5 which is 2 so x is 2 and y is 7 so the number is 27 so the answer is option b a two digit number is such that the product of the digits is 8 when 18 is added to the number then the digits are reversed what is this number well the number is of two digits so we have x y and that can be written as 10 x plus y which is the value of this number then we have been given that the product of the digits is 8 so product is x times y is equal to 8 this is what has been given to us now when 18 is added to the number then the digits are reversed so we are adding 18 to this number so we can write 10 x plus y plus 18 is equal to the reversed numbers value so the reverse numbers value can be written as 10 y plus x let us solve this we can get 10 x minus x is 9 x then plus y minus 10 y gives you minus 9 y plus 18 is equal to 0 so dividing this equation throughout by 9 we get x minus y plus 9 to the 18 so plus 2 is equal to 0 this is an equation that we have got and from this we can say that y is equal to x plus 2 so let us put y is equal to x plus 2 in this equation so x times x plus 2 is equal to 8 so x square plus 2x minus 8 is equal to 0 and the roots of this quadratic equation if you solve it you will get minus 4 and x is equal to 2 so we can ignore the negative value we can take the positive one so x is 2 therefore y's value will be y will be equal to 2 plus 2 and that is equal to 4 so x is 2 and y is 4 so x y which is the number is 24 now the last question a two digit number becomes 5 sixth of itself when its digits are reversed the two digits differ by 1 then what is this number so the two digit number is x y whose value is 10 x plus y now this number becomes 5 sixth of itself when its digits are reversed so when its digits are reversed which is y x the value becomes 10 y plus x now it becomes 5 sixth of itself when it becomes y x so 10 y plus x I can write as equal to 5 sixth of this original number so 10 x plus y so let's move this 6 to the left so we get 60y plus 6x is equal to 50x plus 5y. So we get 60y minus 5y. We get 55y. 6x minus 50x. We get minus 44x is equal to 0. So let us divide this whole equation by 11. So we get 5y minus 4x is equal to 0 therefore 4x is equal to 5y so we can write 
x by y is equal to 5 by 4. Therefore, x's value is 5 and y's value is 4.